All right, so I was just about to start recording and I was gonna spin the wheel to get my daily stuff. And then I noticed this thing, which looks like, I forget, I already typed the one of my turn, I keep forgetting what the red disc is called, but it's on this weird badge looking thing. And I'm not sure what that is. I just realized that replaced the battle points. Battle tokens, oh my god, they actually did it. They changed, I highly doubt they listened to me. People have been complaining about that for years. They actually changed Coliseum points to battle tokens. Thank God. Now they said in the tweet that the reskin, which I correctly predicted being Dractus, which wasn't really that difficult to predict. That just felt kind of obvious, but you know, it's a reskin of Dractus. It's a one in 60 odds. And then there's a 10% chance of it being radiant. Well, that didn't take as long as I thought it would. I'm not too shocked by the design. I already saw it on Twitter. Um, there we go. Lunar New Year Dractus. Didn't get that 10% luck for a radiant, but I think it looks kind of nice. I haven't seen its evolutions yet, but. And there is Lunar New Year Dractus. They are really making good use of textures lately. This thing is covered in artwork, and I like it. Oh, well, would you look at that? Someone got a Radiant over there. And yeah, I think it, I don't know if it's the exact same effect, but I'm pretty sure it's, well, I mean, it's basically just the same thing as uh, Lunar New Year Bun Puff. All right, and we got the first evolution. I'm just using Power Fruits, because getting to level 50, is annoying. And there's fruit trees. I like the giant coin on the front. I feel like I don't have too much to say about fruit. What about fruit trees? As it is just one of those middle stage evolutions. Not too much to talk about. Although I do kind of like how they executed this, like all the patterns, like weaving off. And I like the big old coin. All right, now we should be getting Lunar New Year Sea Drake. I have been spending a lot of battle tokens. I guess we can call them that now. I wish there was a better way of getting power fruits. Okay, well, I can't really see the full model very well, but that looks pretty good from what I'm seeing. Yeah, it looks pretty darn good. I actually really like that. I like, uh, I think it kind of... Uh, it resembles like armor to me. I like this a lot actually. That looks really good. The colors are great as always. Very nice design. Very nice design indeed. I feel like this is going to be a very awkwardly short video, but there's not really much else for me to do here. I got the skin. I do miss events like this, you know, just. It's a simple reskin, plopped into the game, barely takes any development time from the devs. Especially something like this, you know, I mean, it's really the only people that had to work on this. Designers, modelers, animators, I guess. And, uh, I mean, you kind of have to script it into the game, but a lot of it is probably just copy-pasted. Yeah, it's a pretty nice skin. Obviously, it's a very simple event. I don't have too much to say about it. But, you know, I think it looks pretty good. I don't really know what's next because this event ends on the 19th of February. I believe it was the 19th, they said. So we're going to be a little empty for a while. Well, actually, no, Tales of Tenorio comes out the 17th, I think. So two days before this event ends. So I don't know, there's that. We'll, we'll see what happens. But with that, I guess I'll see you again next time.